Welcome back to our Creative Apartment. We love us somewhat. And Kong. Kong. And right now we're going to take a look at Godzilla vs. Kong Warbat. Hey, Chomper, guess what? I got the Warbat out. And he's he's very much loves the Warbat. Gives you a nice little bio. If you want to, you can read. Just pause it yourself. Check it out. Very, very much enjoys this. I love these, these monsters that we're getting. And here is the war bat himself that's in the hollow earth. This guy is awesome. He's got a movement in his tail here. If you want him to, you got movement also in the tail. You can move it around if need be. So you can get him in different striking poses or have him wrap up. He has a hinge for his wings where these can actually move. And then the jaw can actually open, open, and close if you want it to all the way it's very very nice and then you have this little piece here where um it can just click right it's a harder plastic this one here so i have to get my fingernail in it to get it to pop out and then you can have some of that bat battle damage that's on him mm -hmm. um and then it just tabs right back in and when you tab it in it pretty much stays as you heard that click you just click it right in it stays in there um very very cool love how this looks all the way around give you a size comparison here you are with mecha godzilla sorry chomper's in love with him with this guy here can just slam take him by the head Wham! Isn't that what he did to uh, Godzilla and, and Kong? But yeah, here is the Warbat, which I absolutely love. Hopefully I'll be able to find another one since there are like two in there so I could have Kong set up in this nice little battle against the two of them. But if not, I love the fact to have this in my collection. Thank you again, Bay Mahal, for getting this for me. This thing is awesome. Love it. Doesn't have a whole bunch of articulation, but it does ha does the purpose of what it's supposed to do. It's a rendering of the Warbat from the movie, and they gave us the wings that actually move. And they do come off if you want to, so you can actually make it look like Go uh, Kong rips one of the wings off when he's fighting them, which is something why I want to get two of them, because I want to make it look like there's a fight scene between them, like there was in the movie. Um, but the Warbat... Absolute must have. It's an awesome, awesome figure. Thank you again, Bay Mahal. Look, if you're not seeing Kong vs. Godzilla, stop this video right now. Go watch it. You need to. It's an awesome movie. You know what? Someone who doesn't typically watch these movies is Ruben. And Ruben watched it, and he's like, it's the greatest movie of the year for me. And I was like, right on, dude. Right on it is. So here you go. Go check it out. Now you get to find out why... Me and Lord Master Starscream always talk about the Titans, and you'll find out who the true winner is between Kong versus Godzilla. I believe it's more of a tie type thing, but you know what? You go watch it and see it for yourself and let me know what you think. And as my grandfather always says, hold on to something from your youth. You'll never grow old. Look to the stars. Grab one for yourself, guys. Bye.